have done gymnastics for a very long time. It's practically my second home. I think I see my gym friends and coaches more than I see my actual family. So they're, they're pretty much my second family, but almost my first family. I think it's really important to like be there for your friends and because I know I would like them to be there for me if I went through something. So you always try to be supportive of them and like help them through whatever they need. In training, just always look out for your teammates and always try to help them. So if someone needs help with a box, like you can go and help them put away the box or even younger people in your gym who may not necessarily be in your group just go and help them with something that they could be struggling with because the little things like can make a difference to someone's day. With red flags, it's always if they're like their mood has changed, they're not really like present in conversation, they're like really down at gym or they're just like not really right. You can offer support, but if you maybe don't know what to do, then you can tell a trusted adult and they can try to help your friend as well. That's really important and also to, to say to the friend, would it be okay if I speak with my mum or speak with the coach and let them know that maybe something is bothering you? So just so they are aware of who you're going to engage as well. Um, having been trained as a mental health first aider, you do learn to have quite a direct conversation, but you approach your friend, colleague, whoever that person is, and just say, hey, I've noticed that something is a little bit different or you just don't seem to be yourself. So trying to approach it in kind of a friendly manner in a quiet space when there's not many other people around, when they might be open to a conversation and you don't have to be the one to, to solve their problems, but maybe just ask them if they've got someone that they can talk to, if they've got a support person. And I'd also add, you know, after you've had that initial engagement and conversation, maybe check back in you know, when I think about the girls having a, a, a break during you know a training session you know maybe it's a quick chance to just check in you know while you're having a you know piece of apple or, or some little snack to say hey you know do you want to share some you know do you want a piece of mind do you want to have a chat how are things going today hey I noticed you know you, you really hit that particular skill or you look great in training today and just, just really simple short things can, can work as well it's like a like it's like we're all sisters so yeah it's a good bond to have and I mean gymnastics is like my life. I've had lots of opportunities and I've met so many good people.